Hello there, I'm Grant Riley and I'm here to present to you Coming Off The Stage. Let's go and find out what the theatre means to young people of today. At the moment I'm here in the studio. This is where the rehearsals for the youth theatre take place. So I'm here with Caitlin, how are you doing Caitlin? I'm fine, thank you, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, good. Um, so, here today to talk about the youth theatre. Um, what is, what do you like so much about the youth theatre? Why do you attend? Well, well there's the whole, like, the, well, the theatrical bit. You know, I enjoy doing that, that's my most favourite thing to do mm -hmm. really, is, you know, like anything to do with theatre. But then, there's all the people that come and it's just great meeting like new people who've got the same kind of interests as you and so we all get on mm -hmm. and it's just it's a place to meet new friends really because I've met friends there that I've, that I've had for years now because it's, yeah. it's a, like a really different variety of people but we all have that one thing in yeah, common. Yeah, that one thing coming off yes. Um And what's the favourite production that you've ever attended, you've ever been in the audience for? Um, I think that's, it's got to be Decky Does a Bronco, like that's um, that was set, it was it's site specific that was Gridiron, I think that's the production company yeah. that does it in there. They do like site specific performances. So it was out in like coming all fields. Right. And the set was just this big swing set thing and it was just it's just brilliant. It was amazing. Everyone cool. was crying at the end. So <laughs> that's good, that means it's it's moved you. <laughs> that was great. Um and do, lastly just end it, uh, end, uh, do you have any funny stories that you'd like to share with the theatre? Um yes. Pretty much every week there's a new, there's, there's something that happens. I think one, when I first started there was this American guy, Michael, who took the class and he was metal, like really metal. <laughs> and I used to bring a bucket of mini Oreos with me every week and we would all share them. And then one week I went to break and I looked in my bucket and the bucket was empty. <laughs> and Michael and Kat had sat through the first half of the class and ate all my biscuits. So he thought it was, I was quite upset, but he thought it was hilarious, but then he paid me back. Like you know, double the amount of the bits. So that was good. Ah, that was. Um, yeah. Just really, there's just there's there's hunters, there's there's loads and loads and loads. Yeah. So you'd recommend these? Definitely, yeah. definitely, definitely. Who's everyone. Interested yeah. in theatre. Yeah. And I'd rec I just think more people need to come, just even to see performances in uh -huh. the theatre because not enough people do. So. Well then. At the moment, I'm proceeding to the auditorium where the actual shows take place. So I'm here with Jack now, he's uh, actually part of our documentary team, yeah, yes. as it were. <laughs> um, so Jack, what do you like most about the youth theatre? Um, I like you know, the theatrics of it, I liked when I was wee, when I got sent here at like five, it was like, Jack, Jack, you're too hyper, so we're going to send you to theatre and try to <laughs> calm you down, and it's like, no, that's made it worse. But uh, I've also met a lot of friends here at theatre, I've met uh, Caitlin, loads of people that I've known for some years, even people that I've not known for so long, uh -huh. just seen what I've known them for years, so that's really that's, good. That's a good thing. Um, so it's a, a very sociable thing. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's what I kind of meet every, even though we're not meant to just sit and chat. <laughs> we, we really could for like two hours, we could chat for two hours each week. It's good. Mm -hmm. um, so what is your what is your favourite produ uh, production been? Uh, uh, my favourite production been was the RSAMD show we did at here, then we did it actually at the, ah. one, I think it was their small, Theatre, it was different because we got to work with it was a university students ah, okay. who were like, the main director of it. But yeah, it was a different way of looking at theatre, it was a different style and it was, it was really creative and mm -hmm. I met a lot of new people there. That's good. Um, and what is your what is your favourite production being that you've just been in the audience, you've spectated? Um, I've not actually been in a you see a lot of shows, but I did uh, see quite a weird show not a, a while back. It's That's very good. Um, do you have any funny stories yourself that you'd like to I hear? actually do. I've uh, named one of my friends, I don't know if she'll want me to name, name her now, but I will. <laughs> I'll, uh, she, I've named, wait, I gave everyone a sound effect names one day, okay. and hers plop has, plop. has plop, yes, how brilliant. How that, brilliant. That is just, uh, that's just stuck. It's not stuck anymore, but yeah. she doesn't like it. But 
That's just tough. But, uh, I, th I think it'd be pretty harsh. Yeah, yeah, it's harsh. Just into school or college <laughs> or anything. Just yeah, plop. yeah, but it was, it was kind of just here. But it's kind of it's kind of died out. It's kind of matured a bit. So, yeah. Kate, what do you remember about uh, right, the Right, let's box? see what we got. We got like a back, back clog thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, first, th first thing, you're floppy. Yes. You're floppy. The character. Oh my god! <laughs> that sounds oh so god. bad. Yeah, that sounds I so bad. That sounds so bad. That sounds The character is floppy. Thanks, Kate. Thank you. 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 Um, yeah, floppy. Would you fancy giving them you know, a little rendition of floppy? Oh, my name's floppy. Oh, oh man. Brings back right now. It gets me right here every time. Michael banned that, can't we? Michael did ban that. Michael I don't like Michael. No, Michael, Michael if you're watching, we don't like you. No, you hate horror audios. Steve Thieves! <laughs> oh, my good characters, he banned. Spartacus. Spartacus. That's because you did do them to death like, every week, have you? Pretty much. Still get, I still get laughs, I still get laughs. It's like, I don't like that anymore. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that was actually really good. That's like the best production. Yeah, there was, I've seen. There was a few things in it that we, we hadn't done before. Like, it's um, quite a dark show, we've never really done that. It's yeah. And it, I remember we had done a movement piece with Abby, and that's the first time I'd ever done anything like that. Yeah. And um, it was it was fun and it was good and it was good that we'd had even in rehearsals we'd had we'd had it talked through with us by uh, by Caroline. God, she's left now. She yeah. was quality. But uh, <laughs> she was okay. I liked her. But she, she was she was good. But uh, I I liked that I got talked through that as well, like mm -hmm. every step of the way by her. And um, I, I think I think the other thing we done was the first, it was the first time I'd use I'd use sort of a big prop like we had a tower. Yeah, it wasn't it wasn't really a tower, it was more scaffolding than the lights and it. But uh, it was yeah. it was quality using using something like that as well, getting used to it. Well, unfortunately at the time of the filming, the auditorium was closed, but I can assure you opening night was fantastic. But at least we did find out that the youth theatre brings people closer together and it's something that everyone can enjoy. Thanks for watching and remember, Denny Drink. <laughs>